How do you like this using only these? Try these experiments at home and break a record. Blow your mind without blowing up your mom's kitchen. <laughs> Hello, I'm Professor Orbax, and this is my assistant, Sweet Pepper Klopek. And today, we're going to be doing the Guinness World Records Challenge for the fastest time to light an LED bulb using only fruit power. To begin, you'll need four pieces of fruit. I guess today we're using lemons. You're also going to need four different nails. They need to be galvanized because we require the zinc on them. You're going to need an LED bulb, perhaps the most important part, as well as four copper coins. To connect everything, we're gonna need five alligator or crocodile clips. And finally, you're gonna need a voltmeter to measure the output of the actual bulb. Now, because this is a speed record to assemble the battery and light the bulb, for safety's sake, we're going to allow you to cut a hole in the lemon first. Make sure to roll the lemon around a little bit just so that the juice is evenly distributed throughout the lemon. Cut yourself a small slot and insert the coin inside the lemon, making sure it's in contact with the juice. And make sure you get some help if you need supervision. All right, so it's important to clear a workspace. You'll need to repeat the rolling, the cutting, and the insertion of the coin for each of your four lemons. Insert the nail as well. Repeat this for each of your lemons, and then take the crocodile clips to connect them in series. Connect the nail to the coin. And continue to connect the circuit around in series. And at the end, you will have one remaining clip going from one nail and one coin, which you'll connect to your LED. So we're about to connect our LED to our fruit battery. But remember kids, safety first. And here we Go. Science! And now the most important part, the guidelines. When you begin to make your fruit battery, you need to start by laying your hands flat on the table. After a countdown, three, two, one. You may assemble the battery. As soon as the LED is lit, you'll place your hands back down on the table to signal the timer to stop. And done. In order for the record to count, you'll still need to actually measure the voltage across the LED using a voltmeter. Do this by attaching the pokey bits to the bulb itself. Make note of the number. You'll need to send that along with your application. And now for the science. So why does this work? You've just created a battery using lemons. The penny and the nail act as the terminals to the battery. And the actual electrons flow back and forth between the cathode and the anode due to the acidity of the lemon juice. For full guidelines, go to guinnessworldrecords.com forward slash books. For more science, and go! Now that's a nail it take, boys. Looking good, Pepper. <laughs>